This is your diamond inside for tonight of the Presidential Delivery Unit versus Bureaucracy. We attentively listened to President Haka Indihishlima's address during the launch of the PDU at Mulungushi International Conference Center in which he did not mince his words when he took on inefficient ministers, permanent secretaries and other senior government officials. It was interesting to hear President Hichlema comment on the lavish lifestyle of his appointees on a matter he vehemently denounced while in opposition but almost two years later in government his circle is at the helm of using some of the most expensive fleet of motor vehicles. We salute you, Mr. President, for sending a clear warning to officials that have departed from the servanthood, hence leading to inefficiencies. This brings us to the existence of the PDU created last month. It is good the President has learned that there is wrangling among his top brass and some are against working with others which has imposed bureaucratic tape. Since the PDU, led by Mrs. Kasobile Kamwambi, deputized by Ms. Chipokota Monawasa, is meant to accelerate the implementation of high-priority government programs and projects, this indeed will be an important desk that we are keen to monitor. Like we said it last month, when the unit was formed, this is a wake-up call to ministers and other controllers because our assumption is that the president has seen weaknesses in his deputies. Critics may see the PDU as a waste of taxpayers' money to coordinate supervisory works, but we are of the view that if a small number of people can efficiently get the job done, then let the new appointees undertake the mandate. Mr. President, we heard you clearly that you have noticed the inertia and inconsistencies around your circle. Please do not hesitate to replace them because the nation is not short of labor dedicated for national duty.